Okay, guys. We're gonna show you guys the fits of the day. Hey, guys. It's Wen and my outfit. I believe my top is from Shein. My set is from H&M. My shoes are Nike Air Forces. Bag is Prada and jewelry is either Marshalls or Target. Okay, so bag is Chanel. No, I'm joking. So my bag and my shirts are from H&M. Um, sunglasses from Pretty Little Things. The top is from Boohoo, I want to say. Shoes are Converse. Jewelry is a little boutique. And smile by me. <laughs> okay, guys. So today is for exploration. And we're going to meet up with one of our friends, Jennifer, who is already studying in France. And she just landed today. So we're going to link up, see what's all in here. And yeah, let's go. So we were walking in the wrong direction. Um, and now we're turning around. We look like tourists, especially me with all these little feathers. I don't know who I thought it was. <laughs> but basically, I wanted to be a cheetah girl today, so. Got a strut like you me. I think I'll just put this in my purse because I have a really big purse. Look at wind shoes, guys. <laughs> Anyways, y'all, just kidding. I had to change. It was way too hot for all that. Hello, my loves. So we are walking through the streets. I don't even know if people walk through these streets because there's nobody else but us. And then like a few residents every now and then. I'm trying to find a convenient store. Okay guys, update. <laughs> We're on the subway. Look who we found. Hey. Where are we going guys? We're going to Bershka. Um, the metro station here is so clean, so quiet. It's not New York at all. Like, this is it. Look. I feel like I'm riding coach or something in somebody's plane. I am currently on my way back to the hotel. Can you guys guess what time it is? I bet y'all can't. I'll just tell you. It's 9 p.m. and the sun is completely out. Anyways, we're gonna see what the nightlife is like. We might check out a few bars and see who all in here. Good morning, guys. It is day two of Barcelona and we're kind of trying to beat this bus to the bus stop. No, it's gonna beat us. It's gonna beat us. Damn. <laughs> that was our ride, y'all. So anyways, whatever. Now this is a bend. I'll talk to you guys once we have a ride. Hi, guys. So we are currently in El Museo Nacional de Barcelona. And you guys, I'm convinced that Barcelona is literally, I'm turning the camera so much. I'm convinced that Barcelona is literally the best kept secret because we did not know. It was like, oh, so gorgeous. I'm in love with Barcelona. And it has the perfect mixture of like city and nature, as you can see. It's almost like a cleaner New York. I love it. Yes. I'm in love. I mean, no offense to New York. I love New York too, but like, this is like Manhattan times 10. So update about how the trip has been going so far. Yesterday we did some shopping. Where did we go, guys? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Primark. Primark. Yeah. Okay, did we were walking you around. Did you the food at La Roma? I, yeah, I got pictures. Uh -huh. I got. We ate some good food too at La Roma, uh -huh. and we also explored the nightlife. You know, little Ooh. bars and stuff. We don't even have to talk about it. Um, that the was fun. Morning, pretty much. Yes, that was like fun. true Barcelonians. Is yeah. that what they're called, or Catalonians? Oh my god, guys! When we went to bed, the sun was out. Yes, we showered. Okay, we showered and went to bed. Oh my gosh. As soon as Wynn turned off the lights, I seen the sun coming out. I wanted to cry. I was like, we're about to take a nap. Yeah. And then like, it was a slow morning, not gonna lie. I had to get breakfast. This one was dead asleep. Dead. All right, guys, stay tuned. I'll try to vlog as much as I can, but we're really just living in the beach. <laughs> we're going to the beach. Yes, we're going to the beach. We're going to the beach. Oh, we're today. Yes. Wait, I sound like a valley girl. Late, late, later on, wait, later on, we're going to be eating some paella for the first time. Ooh, this is what I mean by living in the moment. <laughs> okay, guys, bye. <laughs> Hey 
Hey guys. Hey. Hello. So we're currently at the beach right now. It is a beautiful evening. It's literally, is it 10 p.m.? No, it's 9.30, I'm lying. I can't flip the camera, but I'll definitely show you guys this right now. It's been gorgeous, it's such a vibe, you guys. Ugh, I'm in love with Barcelona. And it's so crazy to think that we're just so far from home right now. I think we're about to go eat some all-you-can-eat sushi and then call it a night because we honestly have not been sleeping. Like Jennifer and I, literally, what time did you go to sleep last night? Last night I went to bed at 5. Or this morning. This <laughs> morning. <laughs> yes. And then, and then the day before as no, well. I, yeah, I slept at 5 30. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yes. The friend was out when we went to bed last night. It was so yeah. crazy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We had a time last night. But that's, Boy, we had a time last, last night. night. But that's neither here nor there. So we're going to get some sushi and then call it a night. Good morning vlog! Hoy es el último día de Barcelona y ahora nos vamos a la Sagrada Familia y some other stuff. We're enjoying it. We just had brunch. It's a little bit sad because today is the last day and we've been enjoying ourselves so much. I definitely have to come back, have to do the beach. There's so many things to do here, guys. So if you guys have never heard or if you guys were considering it, this is your sign to come to Barcelona because it's so fun. and. Honestly, there's actually a lot of diversity here. Um, I kind of had my little uh, hesitation, but don't listen to TikTok, guys. Like, if you're thinking about coming to Barcelona, just do it at least once. The food is good. I wish I had more authentic food, though. So make sure when you come, you like, you know, consider it of like the little siestas and stuff like that and their hours, because everything is closed on Mondays. But whatever. And it's so easy to navigate the public system too, right? Mm -hmm. Like the metro and stuff. Go ahead. Honestly, yeah, you just look at Apple Maps and you'll get around. You'll be fine. It's so easy. Mm -hmm. And they tell you like when to get off, how yeah. many stops to ride, the buses and everything. Yeah. They're clean. They're clean. Oh my. Clean. Can we talk about that though? <laughs> it's so clean. Like if you guys love Manhattan or New York or big city vibes, like yeah. it's this, but clean and safe yeah. too, which I like. As a woman, I think it's really nice to travel here. Even by yourself, I would feel yes. safe traveling. Yes, even women, especially yeah. women. Yeah. Like I don't feel the need to like have a taser in my hand at all times, you know? <laughs> Anyways, bye guys. to get into the city because we're staying in the suburbs. Mm -hmm. Look at your face mask. <laughs> oh my god. Bonsoir tout le monde, nous sommes à Paris. Et... Bienvenue à Paris. Today I'm going to be giving you guys a little Airbnb tour, so stay tuned. So when you first get to the door, it looks like this. That was the And then you have this little, and then you have this little common area where you can check in. And this is where we like to check ourselves out every day. Just kidding. But then you have the door, password, all that fancy stuff. And this is what you see when you walk in. And then to the right, we have a toilet. With a view, actually, because everything here comes with a view. It has like a little mini sink, 
This is actually my toilet, guys, so enjoy the view. Oops, neighbors, awkward. This is the common area, au déco. This is the little mini kitchenette. It comes with a mini sink, a mini stove, and a fridge is tucked away. This is actually real cute, guys. The only issue is that they really do not believe in AC here. And this is Charlie's room. And in case anyone was wondering, we do not have identity issues. It's just one vacation, so why not, you know, switch it up a bit. And now I'm taking you guys to my room. Do -do 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 -do. First of all, can we talk about how amazing this vase is? And it literally matches my shades perfectly. I like that. So when you walk in here, the first thing you see is the view. And I have a little balcony moment. I'd say this is one of the best features of the room. And then to the left, you have my belongings, this wonderful painting. This is where I keep my things for the day, this wonderful book that I've read one page of, my camera, my fan, which is essential. If you are coming to Europe or any country that does not believe in AC, you need a portable fan. And then we have my bed. This is where I charge everything. So this is where I get ready in the mornings. My toothbrush, face soap, stuff. And then we have this rainfall style shower. It actually, oh no, I wanna show you guys but I don't wanna get wet. All right, that's all you get. That was the room tour. I mean, the Airbnb tour. I forgot to show this part, but the bed comes with reading lights. Not that I'll use it, but you know, that's a cool feature. Today, we have plans to go see the Eiffel Tower, as long as a shopping day. Yes, it's our first official day mm -hmm. in Paris, so. I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can, and I'm sorry if the accent comes out a bit. Alexandria is just a part of me now, and I just can't even stop it. Oh my gosh, guys, today is literally 101 degrees. Oh my gosh, yes. Uh, anyways, we're cute. Let's see how long we can stay this cute for. Um, we're having the time of our lives, I guess. We should go eat something. Yeah, stomach is rumbling. Yes, yes. Rumbling. Hunger on 10. So, bye guys. Talk to you later. Hello vlog. So we have made it to the Eiffel Tower. Not sure if you guys can see it or not. Good morning vlog. So today is the second official day in Paris and we're going to be visiting Musée Louvre. And what else are we doing today, Wen? Um, some exploring, going to Camp Louboutin. Right, a little exploring, a little sho light shopping, heavy on the light. <laughs> She's like, our, our luggage literally cannot fit anything else, so it's heavy on the light, literally. Our luggage yes. is like riding with us on its last wheel, like. Oh my god, my luggage is actually embarrassing. Like, it's to the point whenever I get to like check in, I hide the fact that one wheel is completely broken just so that they can let me through because I'm not trying to get stuck with no broken luggage. But yeah, we're gonna explore. It's gonna be a fun day. I don't know what we're gonna eat yet, but I'll keep you guys along for the journey. There's a breeze in hurry. You guys don't understand the ruggle yesterday. When tell the vlog how long, it, how hot it was yesterday. You know when you were sweating in places that you shouldn't be sweating? Yeah. <laughs> places you didn't know could sweat? Yes, that's the yeah. one. That's the one. That was it. But not today, though. We got a little breeze or whatever. Mm. Oh, we look so cute. So Per. I love how we always, uh, what is it? Coordinate. coordinate yeah. Color. I feel like whoever gets dressed last coordinates with whoever got dressed first. Because <laughs> today I definitely was like, okay, let me see what she wears. That's true, because Shane is always one that dresses first. Yeah. I was ready first today. You guys, I was asleep. But anyways, bye. Hey vlogs, we're currently at the Louvre, and what have we seen so far? Lots of Jesus in, in like different forms, like baby version of Jesus, brown Jesus. There's a lot of Jesus in here so far. Um, look at the view behind us, though. Gorgeous. So we just came back from Galerie Lafayette 
and two amazing things happened. Okay, so for the first thing, for me was the actress Jackie Appiah was there and I got to take a little selfie with her and I was just so excited because like my little childhood came to life or whatever. And for you, me, I made a big girl purchase. Just a little, a little just a little, just a little, just a little, little. Just a little purchase. We'll show you guys later, we'll show you guys later. But, Some um, slight. Right. So now we're walking home before dinner and yeah, we've been working up an appetite, I guess, but really, we just ate, no? I felt like it. Yeah. <laughs> you guys, we had these, uh, we had ramen, and my ramen was greasy as hell. It was good, it was bomb, but it was so greasy. It nearly put me to sleep in the middle of the day. It's been such a beautiful day, beautiful mm -hmm. weather. Way better than yesterday. So it is almost midnight, which is prime time for Charlie to eat a little, a little snack. Charlie, show them what you're whipping up. Wow, some gourmet truffle pasta. Oh, did you end up cooking the beef? It's cooking, yeah. Oh, that's gonna hit. And then we're just gonna order some McDonald's <laughs> when she's done playing around with that pot. <laughs> Anyways, this is the setup. Men in Black 3. Bonjour, vlog. Aujourd'hui est... Day 6. Aujourd'hui est lundi. Our third day here in Paris. Um... And we're about to go to brunch. We had a late start to our morning because we've just been enjoying the weather. It's a little rainy. And honestly, this is the best weather we've had since we've been here. So I'm gonna show you guys a little bit. There's a breeze coming out. Today, we're just going to be exploring um, Montmartre, Sacré-Cœur, all of the works. We're so excited. We have some dinner reservations tonight for the beef bar. We'll see how that goes. Cause we had some reservations for tomorrow too, but we were looking at it. And what I'm realizing is guys, do not set reservations based off of aesthetics because aesthetics will not fill you up. It really won't. Like, please do yourself a favor and look at the menu before confirming reservations. Like, we'll have you going to McDonald's afterwards. Literally, we'll have you going to McDonald's. And order Uber Eats. Yes, do you want to be shown? Are we eating takeout? <laughs> Literally, it's gonna have you so hungry at midnight. But, um. Yeah, so we're just gonna go explore. I'm gonna take you guys with me as per usual. So follow me. So we are on our way to breakfast mm -hmm. and it was a 15 minute walk. And how many minutes do we have left, Charlie? Guys, two minutes. Ooh, there's hella birds everywhere. And these European birds are not scared of people. Okay. Eight more minutes. Are you serious? Uh, you thought. One thing about these 15 minute walks, they go take 30 minutes and it's not because we stop for photos. Dinner. It was delicious, however, baby, that didn't do nothing for nobody. That was a kitty meal. <laughs> right. Like you guys, we made it. Last full day here in Paris. 
and we are on our way to a very special location the palace of versailles yes ma'am uh, it's about 1 30 p.m our reservation was for 1 p.m but girl we was hungry so we had to go mess up some mcdo real quick oh my goodness i don't know if i was hungry or what but that little chicken wrap i had <laughs> tore it up <laughs> yeah we honestly had mcdonald's in barcelona too and it was so trash but um it wasn't that bad here so either we were hungry <laughs> or maybe it's a little bit better here in paris <laughs> next to the uh, palace of versailles in the gardens of the Palace of Versailles and we actually have a little theory we want to tell you guys about. Okay, yeah. I should tell them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell them yours because yours is like a step further than mine. So should I start? Yes, go okay. start, start. So my theory is what if this is all just fake? What if, I can't post this on the internet. <laughs> what if they come check? Oh my God, what they check us? Right, well, whatever. I'll just say it anyways. Okay. But basically I was just walking around and I was like, wow, this is like garden. That one right there, it looks like somebody's front lawn. So I was like, what if this literally... <laughs> what if this is just a tourist attraction? Like there was no Palace of Versailles. King Louis and all the rest did not stay here. What if this... <laughs> and then when you tell them what you thought. Okay, do you guys know like movie sets? Like when you go on set of like movies and you see like all the props or like behind the scenes. Okay, show them that, that building. What if all of that is fake? Like behind all of that is just like fake little stair wooden staircases and like foam pillar. Not so even like, rooms. Not even rooms, like just fake. Like behind that is nothing. Because when, when we went through there and tore around, we just went through a couple little rooms and half of it was like sectioned off anyways. Right. So. Upstairs, anyways. They got, they got some explaining to do. <laughs> These birds are disrespectful. Okay, girl, who my you dress? Maria, this is gorgeous. How far do you guys think we'll make it? I don't know if you guys can tell, but there's like golden statues on the fountain. Currently, we just checked out of the Airbnb. Look, it's so beautiful. Oh, we should have showed you guys a tour. Long story short, it was beautiful. Now we gotta go catch a flight.